Hey guys, welcome to another video. I was scrolling through Instagram and I saw an ad for this jacket. This is a tactical jacket with many different pockets and it looked good. But after doing this for a while, you begin to see patterns in the ads and in the images. I clicked on the item, search Google images. I found a bunch of results, which is the first indicator that this is a catfish item. Now, the interesting thing is, as I started going through the results, there was one result that stood out. So I saw the regular results from different stores, which by the way, look like they are Blarokan and Cutson clones. I'll make a separate video on that later. But I looked through these other websites and one of these websites stood out. It calls the item the Kitanica Mark IV jacket. Now observe that some of these other ones too have the words Mark IV on them, even though they are not sold by the same Kitanica. I found the Kitanica website. One of the things that stood out about this website was that its items were made in the USA. So immediately I began to feel this may be the legit May website. I went to their jackets page and found the Mark IV jacket. And you observe that their logos are on the jacket as well. And here you have the USA made. So this was an indicator that they made this jacket. Here you also see the image itself. Now on these other websites, they tick out these logos and just leave this image. When I scroll down through the website, I observed that they had videos. And if you click on one of the videos, you observe their logo on their jackets. You see a model wearing the jackets. This is the black color. And this looks like the one advertised the Mark IV. This is likely their most popular item has many different pockets. Overall, the website looked legit. So if these guys were the original manufacturers of this jacket, then why were these other websites selling their items? The first indicator was the price. Up here, you see that the price of this jacket here is 669. Most knockoff websites do not price their items this high. It's easier to make money when your items are priced a lot lower. I emailed the company itself first to confirm that they were the original manufacturers of this jacket and secondly just to ask if they were aware that others were knocking off their products i found their contact email fiona at kitanica.com so i sent fiona an email asking her if these items were theirs and if not if she knew who the original manufacturers were fiona responded a little while later and said hi maranatha those are knockoffs from china Recently, we have received lots of emails about those sites. We are working situation right now. So in total, this jacket exists. Now it's very expensive. It costs $600, which explains why it's a popular jacket, but the cheaper ones are more popular than the more expensive ones. Secondly, even while image searching for this item, it took me a long time to track down this company itself. And I had to do that through Pinterest, not through their website itself. So the advertising is very niche, I guess, because of the price. But when you have many websites advertising your products or the knockoffs of your products, if these websites are more known than you are, then you need to compete in a different way. Lastly, it may just be that they're not even competing for the same clients. The clients that Kitanica is competing for are the $600, $700 clients. And these knockoff websites are competing for those who would rather pay about $70. At the same time, it's their IP, so they can price it the way they want. And other companies should not be making knockoffs of their items. It makes sense why their items are this expensive. The item looks very well padded. It looks like if you took a fall in it, you would actually be protected. It has many pockets. It is well designed, which is why everyone likes it in the first place. It may be worth the 600 bucks. I'm not into motorcycle gear. I wouldn't know. And if you are, leave a comment in the comment section and let me know what you think. Now, this particular website, like I stated before, at first look, it seems that these are many different websites. But like I stated before, this is likely just one company with many different websites selling knockoffs of different companies' products. And I'm going to make my next video over that because I see the pattern in the different websites. This group of websites looks like it's made by one company, a Chinese company. The item itself is difficult to find on AliExpress. If you go on AliExpress and you search tactical jackets, you see many different options, but you don't see this specific one. Usually when that happens, but you have many retail stores selling the same item, it's usually because the AliExpress store that would otherwise be selling this runs the retail websites that are selling the items. 
so they don't need to open an AliExpress store and create competition for themselves. They can just manufacture a popular item and make money drop shipping on the spread like retail stores would instead of the slimmer margins they would otherwise make on AliExpress. So chances are the owners of this website and these group of websites are manufacturers themselves in China. I will explore that more in my video next week. Thank you guys for watching. If you found this video informative, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more. Thank you guys. See you in the next one. Bye.